Strain your hair up, Ziok. We're coming in. Here we are. Moxa. Indian fried chicken. Is that what we're doing today, Ziok? Indian fried chicken, he says. Uh, I don't need this. I've got, I've got one here. Does this work? Or is it a prop? Is that tandoori chicken? Is that fermented? Tandoori chicken that I normally have here that is yes. marinated for about two weeks in a variety of different spices that I pull out of India, as well as the yogurt that is made here in house. This gets a pre brine first before it goes into the actual marinade that okay. makes it so that it can hold on for for quite a long time. It could be for two weeks, three weeks, I've gone as far as four weeks. So hang on, wait, how old is this chicken then? This is, this is a couple weeks? This one is on two weeks right now. So what's in here? Right now, uh, water and flour. So it works as an adhesive to pull in all the breadcrumbs that is colored through red beet powder and with a little bit of panko on there to give it some spikiness. So it okay. gives it a little bit of a cool look as well. And then it goes right into the fryer. Okay. What kind of, what kind of temperature are you running there? About 150? 160. 160, all right, that's, that's, that, that checks out. I remember when, when I was young, we used to make paper mache, and we'd make the glue out of, of flour and water. Yeah. So there you go, some science I learned yes, at about five years old, and, and Zed's using it here at Moxa. Making some tandoori fried chicken, and I can't wait. TFC. TFC, all right. It's uh, spinach, kale, and watercress. Okay, I can <laughs> with that. What do we got here? It's way too much to explain. Smoked cheddar, parmesan, bergkäse, different spices going into that. Boiled then, uh, or warmed up rather, in a goat bone marrow broth. A masala paste that's made from dried, sun, well, sun-dried tomatoes, uh, lime juice, a whole bunch of different spices, some garlic, some ginger. Perverted, listen to this We gotta get some of that on there too. Ah. Oh. Listen to it, it's going, oh. That's so sexy right there. Housemade bun, housemade pickles, really nice salad, housemade chutney, housemade super cheesy sauce. We might we might actually chicken. edit all of this out because you're gonna make me look like shit. I'm dripping at the thought of ever eating this monster. Look at this fried chicken. He's got some kind of three cheese sauce going on. It's like got four different types of cheese in this song. Perverse. Perverse, I'm gonna eat it. That crunch, man. That's without doubt the crunchiest fried chicken I've ever had in my life. It's that crunch, the chicken, the crunch. How is it so crunchy? How much science is in this chicken? Yeah, science. In science, man. You know that just um, science. Science that got put in a sandwich and we'll just bang it out. What is this? I, I still haven't processed the flavors that are going through my head right now. Unbelievable. Tandoori fried chicken, I've never had anything like it. We've discovered a few things today, viewers of the fact. There's a few new players out in the chicken game, mocks up. You guys are killing it. And you're doing things that, that I didn't know were possible. I'm gonna have to lift my game now because of you guys. If you have the gauntlets laid down, let's do it. Let's do this. F it. I'm coming for your secrets. You can't hide from us, your chicken secrets.